Hello students, staff, and the Sioux Trail community. I am so excited. It is February, and you know it's I Love to Read Month, Black History Month, a lot going on this month. And every year we always start off each week with a staff member reading a book, and I'm going to start off this year's again. But before we start, I want to let you know we have a theme. So when you came into school this morning, you noticed very, very interesting things in the hallway. This year, our theme is Book Wars, Entering a Reading Dimension. We want you to read and read and read and read. So we're going to start the month off with me reading a story called Flight School by Lita Judge. I was hatched to fly, said Penguin. When do classes start? But you, dear, are Penguin, teacher replied. Undeniable, said Penguin, but I have the soul of an eagle. Teacher and Flamingo weren't so sure, but they let Penguin stay. Flight practice started immediately, like this, flip, flap, flap, and up, up, up. Penguin and the other birds practiced for weeks. At last, all the birdies were cleared for their first flight. One by one, they took to the wind. And then it was Penguin's turn. Geronimo! Glump! I'm sorry, Birdie, said Teacher. Penguins just aren't built to fly. How can this be true, thought Penguin. In my heart, I live on the wind. But as he watched his classmates fly high above, he knew it was time to go home. Penguin was too broken hearted to even wave goodbye, his teachers didn't know what to do. The Flamingo had an idea. Wait! Let's try again. Flip, flap, flip, flap, flap, flap. And up, up, up. Suddenly, Penguin was soaring above the sea and the clouds. Penguin was right. He did have the soul of an eagle. He just needed a little help with the technical parts. But however he felt inside, he still had the body of a little round penguin. But penguin didn't care. He had soared on the wind. Just as he had done in his dreams, he left flight school a happy little penguin. It wasn't long before he came back. My friend Ostrich has the soul of a swallow. Er the end. Thank you for listening to the story of flight school. And I hope each one of you becomes like Penguin. And you take off and you fly and find new adventures in books. And remember, it's the book wars. We are entering the reading dimension where you can learn and grow and find out a lot. I want to tell you about a few upcoming things in February. We have the weekly videos where different staff will be reading. So, hmm, I wonder who might it be next week. And then we have our reading area out in the main hallway. We get to sit in those cool domes and read on the pads that are there. We are going to do a special event with I Love to Read and Mayan and learn about Juneteenth. So that will be interesting. And 
we're going to celebrate National Parent Involvement Day and invite families in. And the next really, really exciting thing is we have our second annual Readathon. And we have goals around that. So when we announce the Readathon, you're going to have to look for all the great prizes. There's very, very exciting things there. You will see last year's we bought books for the library, book for the classroom, and that amazing little library that's going to go outside the building as soon as it gets warm. So remember, read, read, read. I love to read. Celebrate Black History. And I will see you around the school taking flight like Penguin.